Hello. Today's video, we're going to show the dining experience that we had in the Eiffel Tower in the Paris Casino in Las Vegas um, on Christmas Day. Um, this was a really fun experience. We got a window seat, so we got really good views, um, and we had a good time. Anyways, here's what it's like, but as a side note, this video is on the shorter side, so I'm adding some um, footage that we took last year of some of the Lunar New Year decorations that we found while we were out and about. Anyways, I hope you enjoy. After a short elevator ride up to the restaurant, we were seated at a window table overlooking the Las Vegas Strip and the Bellagio Fountain. I love this view. This was a prefix experience where you have a few options to choose from and the adult beverages of course were an additional charge. They do have non-alcoholic options as well. They offer some enhancements for an upcharge as well, of course, which we did order the brioche crown. I ordered the table side mimosa where they freshly squeeze the oranges into your glass right at your table. This is a cute little experience and they do give a generous amount of champagne for the mimosas. Ramar ordered the La Rev a la orange, which is orange juice with vanilla ice cream. These both tasted really good. We did order the brioche crown and I almost forgot to film it. This was super light and fluffy and it kind of just melted in your mouth. For my appetizer, I ordered the slow braised smoked pork belly lyonnaise style. This was very tender and moist. The glaze was on the sweet side and it was cooked to perfection. Rummer ordered the cold foie gras torchon with duck prosciutto and fig compote. This came with toast to spread the foie gras onto. He really enjoyed this dish. It was creamy and spread easily and the prosciutto and compote complemented it really well. For our entrees, I ordered the French toast a la creme brulee, vanilla ice cream, and maple orange syrup. This was an okay dish. It's hard to go along with French toast, but it wasn't standout either. Romar ordered the lobster eggs benedict, which comes with creamed spinach, fingerling potatoes, and topped with hollandaise sauce. This was a really good option. The lobster was light and fluffy and mixed really well with the eggs and hollandaise sauce. Would definitely order that dish again. For our desserts, I ordered the chocolate crunch bar with a malted ice cream. This was a chocolate lover's dream and I loved it. It wasn't too heavily chocolatey and the ice cream was so soft and fluffy. Romar ordered the Eiffel Tower creme brulee. This is a very smooth custard and it tasted wonderful. The berries that came with it helped tone down the sweetness. It was a decent creme brulee. Overall, this was a really fun experience and we would definitely do this again. The food was great, the views were of course amazing, um, but with that being said, and like I said earlier, uh, this was shorter, so um, we're going to show the footage of the Lunar New Year decorations that we found for the beginning of 2022. So every year for Lunar New Year, some of the bigger casino hotels like the Bellagio and Aria, just to name a couple, do elaborate decorations to celebrate the Lunar New Year. These are some of the displays we were able to go see while we were out and about. Some were quite elaborate and all were beautiful.
So that's it for this video. We hope you enjoyed it and we'll see you in the next one. Thanks for watching.